Didn't you just love the picture? I did. But I just felt so sorry for the creature at the end. Sorry for the creature? What'd you want him, to marry the girl? He was kind of scary looking, but he wasn't really all bad. I think he just craved a little affection, you know, a sense of being loved and needed and wanted. That's a very interesting point of view. <laughs> oh, do you feel the breeze from the subway? Isn't it delicious? Sort of cools the ankles, doesn't it? Well, what do you think would be fun to do now? I don't know. It's getting pretty late. It's not that late. The thing is, I have this big day tomorrow. I really have to get to sleep. What's the big day tomorrow? Tomorrow I'm on television. You remember I told you about it? The Dazzle Bend Hour? Oh, here comes another one. Tell me, Dazzle Dent toothpaste, it's funny, you know, I don't think I ever tried it. You should. It's excellent toothpaste. Is it? Oh, yes. I use it myself. Oh, then you do recommend it. I mean, off the record, between friends. Definitely. It costs only a few pennies more than ordinary toothpaste, but a recent survey shows that eight out of ten oral hygiene... Now you sound like a commercial again. If I believed every commercial I heard. <laughs> you can believe this one. Every word of it. What's that you say on the program? He'll never know because I stay kissing sweet the new Dazzle Dent way. <laughs> now, really. It's true. I'll prove it to you. Well? My faith in the integrity of American advertising is somewhat restored. You see? However, before I go to all the trouble of switching brands, I want to make absolutely certain 